Hi everybody, Elin here. I know I'm a day late with this video, but I mean, better late than never, right? And today I come to you guys with my Outcrate unboxing for the month of July. And I think the theme was like Wanderlust, 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 something like that. And yeah, I've been really exciting for this. Uh, and I'm waiting for this package because, well, it's like Christmas every time. Um, for you guys who don't know, this is a book subscription box that you get each month. And it's usually you get a book, um, a newly released book. And around that book, is, there's a theme. And then you have like, I think it's three to five bookish goodies that are supposed to connect with that theme. And yeah, I think we should get started because for some reason I'm getting cramps in my hand by holding this, which means I have no be <laughs> upper body strength. <laughs> and the package is open, and I'll show you guys first. So much prettiness, right? Let me put this down. Okay, um, and this it says. This is the card which it has all the spoilers on the back side, so I'm not going to look at that. Uh, but it says, greetings from Alcree. And then actually the girl on this card actually have a Gryffindor t-shirt. So, I mean, can't help but love that. But yes, this theme is Wonderlust. So, close enough. Ooh, I see. I see something. Um, and the first thing I see is a Pocket Pop keychain from, well, Funko, I believe it is. And it's a Fantastic Beast one. And I love Fantastic Beasts. And I got Newt Scamander and it looks so adorable. I'm going to pick him out and I can show you guys a little bit better so you don't get that shiny glare in your faces. Because that's annoying. But yeah, this is a keychain and it's Newt Scamander and it looks freaking adorable. And I'm definitely going to put this on my keychain because I love Newt Scamander and Eddie Redmayne because it's awesome. And then I have something that I'm pretty sure is inspired by Lord of the Rings because reasons. And I'm just going to take all the worms away. What is this? Is this some kind of toad? Uh, oh! In Sweden we call this a gym bag, but I mean, maybe other people call this it differently. Um, but this is like a little bag and you can pull the straps and it closes. And it's definitely inspired by Lord of the Rings because, well, you can see the script here. And it says, um, Home is behind the world ahead, and there are many paths to tread. Um, through shadows to the edge of night until the stars are all alight. And I really love Lord of the Rings. I love the movies. I've read the books, and I really, really like them. And, yeah, look at this gorgeousness. Yeah, I don't know who it's from. I don't want to spoil myself. And this um, little backpack thingy is exclusively made by Owlcrate. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely be using this one. And next I see the little pin you get each month. And this one is supposed to correlate with the card it got you uh, earlier. And as you can see, it is the little airplane um, and tree. So yeah, that's awesome. And then, ooh, I see a little pouch. And for some reason, the things that they put in the pouch, they're never in the pouch when I get the package. So I'm guessing this thing that is supposed to be in here is somewhere in the box. So yeah, this is empty, but I'll find the thing that is supposed to be in here. Hopefully, we'll get to it. Maybe this was the one that was supposed to be in there. Um, this is like a pocket mirror and it says S Travas. Ah, that's from Dark Shit of Magic. See, I know things. I'm getting up to date with all my reading. Um, but yeah, that's the word you say when you want to travel through the different Londons. So it's a little pocket mirror and you, I mean, you always need that. And it's just the words and then there's like a rose there and it looks so beautiful. So I'm guessing that was the one that was supposed in the pouch. Um, and then I see something, I have no idea what it is. What is this? <laughs> oh, it's a bag tag. Oh, that's cute. Um, this is made from Mud Puppy or something like that. So I'm going to open this. Okay. Okay, so this is a bag tag that you can put on your suitcase if you're going anywhere. And it's just a little owl and looks adorable. And it's made by my puppy, like I said before. And then on the back side, you can write your name and address and everything like that. 
so yeah it's really really cute and i'll definitely use this next time i'm away um then i see i think it's uh, um it's from Na 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 Toto Na I don't even know and it's a little journal thingy uh, with a lot of houses on it and yeah it's cute and I didn't use to actually like use these kind of items like um, notebooks and journals and things but then I started using them for like my booktube ideas and my book blogging and reviews and everything and so I definitely will use this and it will definitely run out of it very quickly I suppose um, I think the only thing no it's another thing here this is a art print and it says I go to seek a great uh, perhaps I don't know where this is from or what it is like inspired by oh I just saw the book oh my god I've been wanting to read that book <laughs> I had so not 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 a single clue what book it was going to be in this box, but I just saw the cover of the book. And well, parts of it actually, and I realized which book it was. And I've been wanting to read that one for so long. I'm so happy. But now we're going to focus on this print. I have no idea what it is supposed to be about because, oh yeah, uh, the dark shade of magic thingy. Um, the mirror is made by um, Miss Fi. Um, the pocket journal is from Uli. And the art print is from Shelley and Designs, and it features a quote by Francois Rabella, <laughs> and is also inspired by the novel Looking for Alaska, and that's an exclusive design for Alcrete. Oh, so yeah, I haven't really read that book, nor know, do I know who Francois Rabella is, but I'll figure it out. Um, but next we have the book. And it's supposed to be an exclusive. Oh, things are falling. And it's an exclusive cover. And I think the thing they've changed is the color because I think the cover is green. It's gonna be a little bit nice blue, but I'm gonna show you guys. And the book is *The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue* by Mackenzie Lee. And I've heard so many great things about this book, and I've been wanting to read it. And I was going to buy it on ebook but now i have a physical copy and it's awesome and it's such a beautiful blue i'm gonna see what color this one's made okay it is black and then the text is in yellow um but like i said this is an exclusive cover so yeah i think it's the color scheme that is different um but i heard so many amazing things about this i'm gonna see because i don't really remember um but in this one you meet henry monty Mon montago month ago I don't know and he was born and bred to be a gentleman but he was never one to be tamed um, in the finest boarding schools in England and the contest constant disapproval of his father haven't been able to curb any of his roguish passions not for gambling halls late nights spent with a bottle of spirits or waking up in the arts or a woman or man um, but as Monty embarks on his grand tour of Europe his quest for a life filled with pleasure and vice is in danger of coming to an end. Not only does his father accept him, so expect him to take over the family's estate upon his return, but Monty is also nursing an impossible crush on his best friend and traveling companion, Percy. Still, it isn't in the Monty's nature to give up, even his younger sister Felicity in tow. He vows to make his year-long esca escapade one last hedonistic hurrah and float with Percy from Paris to Rome. But one of Monty's reckless uh, decisions turns the trip abroad in a harrowing manhunt that spans across Europe. It calls in qu into question everything he knows, including his relationship with the boy he adores. Oh, I want to read this one right away! Which I can't because I have to go to work soon! That's... that's not fun. Anyways, um, with the book you get a couple of things. Oh, is this a poster? I think it's a poster, yeah. Um, so on this one it says the gentleman's guide to Europe, and then I suppose it's the countries he visits in the same place, and I actually see Sweden. Can you find Sweden? Because that's where I live. Anyway, so he obviously goes around Europe and a little bit Scandinavia, and yeah, nice poster. I'll put this up somewhere. I'm running out of space. And then we have 
um, the little note from the author and there's a lot of illustrations on it as well but I'll read this more later and then as usual with our crates boxes which I love it's a signed book plate and I like I said I've been wanting to read this book so I mean signed edition ha, going to read that I'm going to put this in which will probably take like forever because I suck at this for some reason look at that beauty it looks so pretty oh my god all crates always have such good books in their all crates like I always give them like not almost always give them really really high ratings and like I said I've been wanting to read this one and I can't wait to start I just need to finish some books I'm reading at the moment but then I'm definitely going to read this one and then there's really only one thing left in this box and it is the theme for next month and the theme is uh, for the August box then is something wicked this way comes and on the back you get a little sneak peek um, in the August box you'll receive an additional exclusive box Ooh, awesome you get two books and uh, the exclusive book um, comes from rock paper books and it seems to be classics um, so I can see here Peter Pan, Dracula um, yeah I can't really read the titles of the other ones uh, but yeah it seems to be classics so I guess it's like new covers for them and that's really awesome and um, yeah I mean something wicked this way comes is obviously going to be with witches and things and I love that because I adore Charmed and um, yeah that's going to be awesome and I mean this card is really pretty as well so that's great <clears throat> but yeah those were all the items in the box and I absolutely loved it and I'm looking forward to the book and I'm really, my little Newt Scamander that's going to follow me everywhere and he gets to go to work with me later today and yeah it was really really nice and can't wait to start a book I've said it 50 million times I know you're going tired of it but yeah this was all I had for this time please don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you liked it and I will also link um, our crits, um home page for their website down below if you're interested in getting your own box and yeah don't forget to subscribe to my channel which you can do by clicking the little button down below and yeah I hope we see each other next time which is actually tomorrow because this video goes up one day late but yeah see you tomorrow bye